a loving day to you all divine infinite light beings feminine energy the gorgeous feminine energy the fine masculine energy ashe um the goddesses and the gods ashe the faithfuls the golden children ashe greetings to you all spirit has divinely guided me back here once again ashe um to deliver a message ashe spirit was saying that there is someone um, that you went out with, Ashe, whether this was a hookup between you and this person or a hookup between, um, you know, a family member hooked y'all up, a friend hooked y'all up, a co-worker hooked y'all up, or you hooked up through a dating site, Ashe, um, you were hooked up, Ashe, and in the moment of you being hooked up, in the mo moment of you getting together and um, this person taking you out or you taking this person out, Ashe, um, you felt like it was supposed to be a mutual agreement, Spirit is saying, Ashe, um, this energy had the same feeling at first, Ashe, or this energy was filling you but not quite ready to go all the way into um, what you were feeling, Ashe, and this was a one night stand, um, a hookup, a casual sex thing, Ashe, and um, yeah, um, this energy got in their head about it, Ashe, the energy got in their head about it, and in the process of y'all going out, having a nice time on the town with 133 on the clock having a nice time on the town or you know y'all could have went to the movies y'all could have went out for a day y'all could have went to a family function wh wherever y'all went to, to hook up to have a good time to to chill to get to know each other ashe um to get to this next event after the hookup ashe um after the getting to know each other ashe um the other energy got cold feet, Spirit is saying. The other energy wasn't feeling um, what you were feeling. The other energy um, didn't mean to turn you on, Ashe. And um, I got that song. <clears throat> he said, when I took you out, I knew what you were all about and uh, uh, and. I didn't mean to turn you on. So, um, he knew or she knew what the situation was. How y'all met, what y'all was going to do. He said, I knew what you were all about. So, before I took you on this date, I knew that we were supposed to fuck on the date or after the date. We were supposed to, you know, get between... In between the sheets. Yeah, you were supposed to get in between the sheets, Ashe. And on the date, he had a different, or she had a different feeling. She didn't just want to take advantage of you. She didn't just, this, this, he didn't just want to jump in the sheets. He he felt some, he didn't want to do that. He, he caught himself. She caught herself, Ashe. And this, um threw you off. This this took you for a loop because you already knew what the situation at hand was going to be. Y'all already knew what the mutual attraction was going to be. Y'all already knew that y'all were two consenting adults. Ashe, spirit is saying confirmation with the bells in the background. Ashe, confirmation. And so, um, yeah, he just said, I didn't mean to turn you on. You know, I knew that it was supposed to be a one night stand. But, oh... I didn't mean to turn you on. So he, he could have lost his confidence. She could have lost her confidence. Or she could have just not wanted to take advantage of you. Or he could have just not wanted to take advantage you, of you in that moment. Because in that moment, it was a vulnerable moment, moment for this person who said, Hur! you know, gave you the Jamie Foxx hand and, and said, no, this is not what I want to do. This is not how I want to pursue this. Ashe, and so it, yeah, it put them in they, they, they mental capacity of thinking when, even when you were at the movies, even when you were at the family function or the birthday party, the wedding, Ashe, um, even when you were, you know, selling in the boat, Ashe, you, they got to thinking, 
you know, I don't want to go through with the one night stand. Maybe I want something more. Maybe um, I want, I didn't really want to take it that far. Or, you know, maybe I didn't think this other person really was going to take it that far, Ashe. But, you know, at that moment, he said, I didn't mean to turn you on. Yeah, he, not like you were turned on. You was hot. You was ready. You was ready to give up them draws, take them off, whatever. You was ready. It was two consenting adults. And you thought that this person, whether it be a feminine energy or masculine energy, was ready. And Spirit is saying they were not ready. Ashe, something about the situation, they just didn't want to go further with that one night stand. So we're going to just jump and see. You know, because, you know, they didn't feel like that this was, you know, the right thing to do. They have a heart. They have some compassion. They have some, you know, empathy, sympathy. You know, they don't, they're not the type of person. So they, this could have been your divine, infinite light being. Not the type of person to just, you know, sleep around um, so quickly, so easily. Ashe justice spiritual justice brought a stop to them taking advantage of you in the moment ashe because a one night stand is like a casual um i'm gonna take advantage of you you're gonna take advantage of me and then we're gonna split and that's gonna be it ashe we 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 can sit on taking advantage of each other ashe that's what a one night stand is and in that instant listen to those bells in the background they didn't want that maybe they wanted more so we're gonna see Thank you, Divine Spirit. Um, earth, air, fire, water, ether. Drive away all harm, fear, negative energy. Whatever does not serve me, release it from me. Ashe, and protect me from all harming energies. It is so, so it is, and so more to be in my scarred and sacred space. Ashe, Ashe. Thank you, Spirit. Gratitude. I welcome in my entire Divine Spiritual Love War Team to protect me, Archangel Michael at the head and i welcome in your divine spiritual love war team to protect you with archangel michael at their head i say i say and i give much gratitude i say spirit we ask that you reveal to us why this person didn't want to go further why this person did not want this one night stand i say thank you spirit five of coins because they didn't just want to get left behind i say they didn't want to be caught up in their head about having a one night stand or they didn't want you to feel like they just wanted to leave you behind because spirit is saying they wanted more. So they got caught up in their head. They didn't want to give you this one night stand to feel like, oh, if I give this this energy, this one night stand, then that's it. I'm not going back for more. She she or he is not going to want any more. So within that instant, Spirit is saying they thought about it. Long, hard, and good about it. They was thinking about it before they even this thinking about it before the date. So they thought about it before the date, Spirit is saying. And they knew that they just didn't want a one night stand with you. A one night stand is leaving you behind, taking advantage and leaving you behind. I say thank you, Spirit. What else, Spirit? What else do um yeah, because you're a loving person. They didn't want to leave a loving person behind. They had felt some more attraction for you. They felt um, um, something deeper than a one night stand. They wanted something to develop into this relationship. That's why they was like, hold it. I didn't mean to turn you on. Let's get to know each other. That's what I'm feeling with 141 on the clock. They wanted to get to know you because they felt this loving energy. This is the Queen of Cups. You are a Queen of Cups. You are a King of Cups. You you know, you are high value. And, and they were in their head about this. They just didn't want to turn you on and fuck you and leave you. No, they wanted more from you, Ashe. And that's why it didn't go your way, Ashe. This is what they are looking for. This is why it wasn't so easy for them to, um, maybe some of you did give it up, right? But not as much as you wanted to, you know? Maybe you thought you were going to have, um, you know, a fuck buddy, um, you know, my buddy, um, you know, that type of situation. Or um, 
maybe you they were getting to know you wanting to get to know you and maybe y'all did have some kind of intimate act action but not as much as you wanted to have confirmation because they didn't want to feel like they were just fucking you and leaving you Ashe. they didn't want you to just feel like they were fucking you and leaving you they wanted to have more with you, Spirit is saying, and this kept them in their head. They wanted to attend a Pentacles type of relationship. They, he said, I didn't mean to turn you on, uh, uh, but I did. He know he turned her on. She knows she turned him on, but she didn't mean to turn on that red light in that instant. They wanted that down the line. You know, they know that is automatically to come. But they wanted to get to know you further without turning you on in a sexual manner to make you feel like that's all they wanted was that sexual manner. They wanted more. And they were caught up in their heads about this. Ten of Pentacles, stable foundation. And maybe they couldn't turn you on because they, you know... They didn't want to turn you on because they had somebody at home. Take the messages as they resonate. Ten of Pentacles right here. T take the messages as they resonate for you. Either they were single and didn't want to turn you on because they didn't want to leave you, fuck you and leave you. Or they didn't want to turn you on because they knew they shouldn't have been out on that date because they have somebody else at home. I say take the messages as it resonates for you. I say. But he said, I didn't mean to turn you on. I knew that it was supposed to be in the one night stand. So some of you could have known that um, this person had somebody at home. I say maybe they weren't happy at home. Maybe they weren't stable at home. Maybe they weren't even fucking at home. You you understand me? But um, and y'all made this agreement. I say this is this my situation. This your situation. We gonna get together. We gonna be two a sitting consenting adults, and we gonna do what we gonna do, and then we gonna go our separate ways. But this person wanted more. I say, thank you, divine spirit. What else do you have for the collector? Give us some more information as to what more did this person want from the divine collective energy. I say, thank you, spirit. I am a little spark of light. You are the divine. We are the divine creators. Infinite light means together we come together. To, together we come together to communion. <laughs> and and, and, and um, illuminate the world with our light. Ashe, thank you spirit. Messages are always timeless, past, present, and future. But we, we like to um, indulge ourselves in the present. We like to bask in the energy of the present. We like to uplift ourselves in the positivity of the present. Ashe, and we give thanks and gratitude for that. Ashe, this card came out on the side. Let's see what it is. The Queen of Swords. Ashe, yeah, they didn't want to get cut off by you. After the, after the one-night stand, they didn't want you to cut them off. They wanted more than a one-night stand. They wanted more than a one-night stand. And they knew, you know, if they took it the way y'all arranged it, it was going to be just that. Spirit is saying, if they would have took this one-night stand with you, divine infinite light beings, masculine energy, feminine energy, if they would have took this one-night stand with you, they would, they know off top that they was going to be axed. That it was going to be just a one-night stand. And then they, they, you were going to give them the axe. They didn't want that. They didn't want that. They wanted more. Spirit is saying they wanted more. I say they seen more out of it than just a one night stand. Uh, thank you, Spirit. What can you tell us? Ooh, my knuckles. Mmm, poor babies. Mmm. Um, what can you, what can be gentle with yourself? Sometimes I'll be beating up on myself. I'll be a little rough. Spirit said, don't be rough on yourself. Don't beat up on yourself. Be gentle with yourself. Love and give yourself nurturing, tender care. I say, and this is what this person seen in you. That's why they don't want to be axed. They want that love and tender care that you got. I say, thank you, spirit. What can you give us some information, spirit? Can you give us some messages, messages, more messages? Because that was a, a deep message off top. Can you give us a message? 
spirit of, as to what more do they want um the, these energies ashe thank you for the confirmation in the background what more does these energies want from the divine collective ashe um a passionate loving strong connection is what they want with this knight of wands ashe yeah that's why they didn't want to they didn't want to take advantage of you even though you wanted it, even though it was consenting, even though you was ready to cock those legs wide or um, 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 make that wand stand up, Ashe, yeah, they didn't want it that way, Ashe. They, they just didn't want it that way. They didn't want confirmation. They didn't want to feel like they was taking advantage of you, Ashe. And so now that the, the, um, the one night stand did not go through and they had to put put a stop to it like Jamie Foxx so some of y'all could like the show Jamie Foxx some of y'all could like Braxton because I keep getting Braxton um the character Braxton um or y'all could have just liked that hand you know the way he did that hand Ashe but they're trying to manifest you back Ashe because they didn't even get to some of them didn't even get to experience the one night stand spirit says some of them y'all did get intimate a couple of times a few times you know on occasion that was like more than, that was one night stands like over and over again, Ashe. Because nothing developed in the relationship, Ashe. But they're trying to manifest you, Ashe. Thank you, Spirit. They, they want more. Thank you, Spirit. They want more. Plain and simple is that they want more, Ashe. Two of Wands. They made the decision. They're planning, Ashe. Whether this is past, present, or future, you could have already went through this. You could be getting ready to go through this, or you could be going through this now, Ashe. But they're planning, because this is the, the three of wands, the two of wands. They're planning to get back in your in energy, Ashe, because they want more than a one-night stand. They didn't want to just turn you on and turn you off. They wanted to turn you on and keep you on, Ashe. Two of cups, keep you on. They wanted to turn you on and keep you on. They wanted to tune in, tap in, and turn on to you permanently. That's why they didn't want to make you feel like they was taking advantage of you. That's why they didn't want to take advantage of you. That's why they they wanted something everlasting. Two of cups, Ashe. Two of cups. That's why he said, I didn't mean to turn you on. Yeah, because we knew both of us was coming in to do this one night stand. But when I got in here to do this one night stand, my heart started feeling something more than a one night stand. My heart started feeling like this could be the one. And so I don't want to make him or her feel uncomfortable by just fucking them and saying that's it. Because this could be the one. Ashe. Thank you, Spirit. Remember, we got that in the message. You, you the one. The one. You the one. You are the one. Ashe. Thank you, Spirit. What else do you have for the Divine Collective? We're 150 on the clock. I know I'll be overwhelming y'all with these messages, but Spirit wants these messages out, so I get them out. I, I'm backed up with messages. Don't think that I'm on time with these messages. I'm, I'm backed up with these messages. So, um, if y'all think I'm, you know, doing too much, I have not done enough because I am backed up, Ashe. So, um, but these messages are for you, Ashe. Um, 151 on the clock. Thank you, Divine Spirit. Let's get an angel number. We got 212. We got 211. 211. This isn't two. What is 211? 211 is a spiritual angel number. Yeah, but is that information? What is that? Okay. Seven of Wands. Yeah, they knew that they wanted to pr protect you from being hurt by a, a, a one night stand, being hurt by somebody that didn't want them, being hurt by or thinking that somebody didn't want them, thinking that they were you were not worth nothing but a one night stand. They they wanted to protect you from this. They were doing you a favor. Ashe or you were doing them a favor. Ashe take the messages as it resonates for you, Ashe, but they didn't want they wanted to protect you from 
the energy of just feeling used and abused, Ashe. That's what they wanted to do with the Seven of Wands, Ashe. Spiritual protection. That That is my spiritual protection, Ashe. Um, card, Ashe. Yeah, in their head about it. They made up their mind that they didn't want to take advantage of you, Ashe. They wanted to be a knight for you. Whether feminine energy or masculine energy. See how this landing on top of the Queen of Swords? They didn't want to get cut out because they wanted something more than that one night stand. I didn't mean to turn you on. Not like that. Not like that. They wanted to turn you on, tap in, and tune in, and turn on to you forever. Not just for one night. Not just for one night. They didn't want it to be no secret lover. They didn't want it to be no weekend love. They wanted more than that. King, queen, king of wands. King and queen of wands. Manifesting you. Ashe. Because they wanted more than just sex. They wanted a commitment with you. They wanted a relationship with you. That's why they didn't go forward into continuing to, if y'all did lay down, continuing to comp confirmation to take to violate you take advantage of you or if y'all didn't lay down they didn't even want to do that at all because this is a loving being just like you are you you came out in the beginning as the queen or king of cups this is a loving energy such as you are and they didn't want to do that they didn't even want to feel used and abused themselves i say because you know when you do a one night stand it, it, you know, usually you, you'll hook up at a bar, at, at a club with a one-night stand. Or if you traveled, you'll hook up with somebody with a one-night stand. Um, how, uh, you know, going out with friends, you'll hook up with a one-night stand. How, how else? You know, meeting somebody. You know, that's like in the day of it. But this was a plan. Some of this was plans. Some of y'all was planned. Some of y'all was the day of it. You know. You know, just getting together, um, chopping it up at a party, at a where it, a function, whatever. And you decided, oh, I it's you know, it's some kind of sexual chemistry there, Ashe. So we gonna go ahead and do this, Ashe. But at the time it was like, ah, no. Because it's more than just a sexual chemistry. I say thank you, spirit. This king of wands really wants to be loved. This queen of wands really wants to be loved. And they wanted to be loved by you. I want to be loved by you. And you. And you. And nobody else but you. They see how stable you are. I want to be loved by you. Alone. Boop, boop, be -doo. Yeah. So they want you and nobody else but you. And they want you to be the same way for them and just just me and you oh baby yeah just the two mm. and just me and you just the two yeah because that's what they really wanted spirit is saying that's what they really wanted this this stable ass king of pinnacles or queen of pinnacles, Ashe. This is how they see you as well, Ashe. So, you know, when you hooking up with a one night stand, you expecting not to see this person again. So this could have been somebody that's been admiring you for a while. Or this could have been a friend of yours. Or this could have been my buddy. You know, you know, someone you thought that it was going to be cool confirmation to be a fuck buddy, Ashe, but it turned out this person wanted more than just to be a fuck buddy, Ashe, Ashe. So, yeah, thank you, spirit. Clarify this two of wands. That's a lot. Yeah, they didn't want to give you no illusions. They didn't want you to feel like it was an option. And they didn't want to give you no illusions. They had already planned this out. Maybe that was just a way to take you out. Maybe that was just a way to meet you. Maybe that was just a way to um, break the ice. Ashe is to say, okay, yeah, I agree with what you want. Take the messages as they resonate for you. Maybe that was them being cocky in the moment. You know, because this could have been a player or a player at Ashe. 
or it could have been somebody in a relationship, Ashe, because we've seen that, Ashe, or it could have been somebody who had just gotten out of a relationship. It was just looking to um, be interested in you um, for that moment, but realized they wanted more than a moment, Ashe. Thank you, Spirit. Clarify this two of cups. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you, Spirit. My crown is on fire right now. Thank you, Spirit. I am grateful to be the vessel in the moment. Thank you, Spirit. We're 151 on the clock. Four of coins. The four of cups. Yeah. They didn't want to feel disconnected after that, you know. Because, you know, when you lay down and you use that kundalini energy, there becomes a connection. I don't care if it is a one-night stand. That is just some, some, someone else with a soul tied up inside of your spiritual energetic realm, Ashe. And so, um, they didn't want to be that, Ashe. They wanted more than that, Ashe, with this um, Princess of Cups. They, they felt some kind of um, sympathetic, um, empathetic feeling. They had some kind of true spark that you could be the one with this Princess of Cups, Ashe. They knew that, you know, this could be a start of something emotionally balanced, Ashe, with the way they felt about you. With the with the um the energy that exuded off of you, Ashe, the rays that flew flowed off of you, Ashe, very positive. They knew that it was a very it could be a very fertile um relationship, Ashe, a relationship that could grow and 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 if you don't stop it, a relationship that could grow. Spirits just said it and it popped out. And that's why they wanted to protect you. Ashe, they didn't want you to feel used, abused, confirmation, mistreated, taken advantage of, such as some women do, such as some men do. So, And you should be thanking spirit because motherfuckers don't give a fuck how they take advantage of you. Motherfuckers will fuck you all day and leave you for dry. Ashe, fuck you dry and leave you there. Ashe, but this person, this energy did not want to do that. This energy wanted to protect you to the fullest. Ashe, they wanted something sacred with you, with this four of wands. Ashe, two o'clock on the on the on in the PM on the clock, two o'clock. Ashe, they wanted something solid and stable. This four of wands, so they that's why they were protecting you by not laying down and having a one night stand with you. Ashe, thank you, spirit. Clarify this nine of um, wands. This nine of swords, Ashe. And so now, they've been all up in their head about it. Since, you know, y'all have not been um, talking, Ashe, because maybe you got mad. You cut them off. Maybe you cut them off. Maybe you stopped talking to them, Ashe, but they're spying on you because um, they're all up in their heads about it. They want to communicate how much they want more than just sex maybe y'all were in a relationship and 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 they didn't want you to feel like it was just sex ashe it could have been that too y'all could have been um going good going strong ashe and then um they just didn't you know wasn't giving it up like you know how you felt they should have because they didn't want you to feel used and abused. Take the messages as they resonate for you. Thank you, Spirit. This King of Cups wanted equal love. Wanted the same type of love that he had, she had for you or within them. They seen it in you. We seen the Queen of Cups came out first. Ashe, this is right on top of this Knight of Cups. This night, night of wands, coming in real passionate for your ass, but coming in strong and emotional for your ass, emotional stability for that ass with that king of cups, 
Ashe with that Queen of Cups coming in very loving and loyal and dedicated. That they wanted to be dedicated to you. They wanted to be loyal to you. They didn't want you to feel like you were worth nothing. They wanted to hold you in high value. That's why they didn't just want to fuck you and leave you for that one night. Or that's why they just wasn't fucking you, fucking you, fucking you, fucking you, fucking you. As you have been getting done in your past relationships. With a motherfucker that didn't give a fuck. Just stayed up in there. Or just wanted to stay up in there. Or just kept your legs cocked open. You know, that type of energy. They did not want to be that type of energy. I say, thank you, spirit. They didn't want to be that type of energy. At all. They seen potential. They seen potential. Ashe, thank you, spirit. Clarify this king of wands. <sighs> the star. They seen potential. They seen the, who the fuck you was. They seen who the fuck you was. Because they was... Me, me, you, you were mirroring each other. That's why at first it was okay. Because y'all was mirroring each other. You know, we're going to get this, we're going to get our nut off, and we're going to go on our separate ways, and we ain't going to, you know, have no tides, we ain't going to feel bad about it, we ain't going to fuss about it, we ain't going to argue about it, because this was a mutual fucking agreement. And then when they got into it, they was like, oh no, this is some special shit right here. If, if they did touch it or if they didn't touch it, they knew that it was special. Landing right on top of this, this King of Wands landing right on top of them, manifesting you with this Three of Swords. Stop playing. They knew that it was a healing energy. They knew that it was an energy sent from the divine, sent from heaven. They knew that. They knew that. They knew that you were a loving energy. They knew that they you were an energy. You hear the bells in the background? They knew that you were an energy that should not have been taken advantage of. In such a sexual manner, Ashe, in such a lustful manner, I didn't mean to turn you on. I'm sorry, baby. I didn't mean to turn you on. When I took you out, I knew what you were all about, but something then, something clicked. Something clicked. I didn't mean to turn you on. Yeah. Here it is, the Ten of Pentacles again. That's what clicked. This could be a solid relationship. This could be a cool foundation. This could be happy and fertile and prosperous. I say nine of wands. They was guarding you from illusions. They was guarding you from making uh, making you a choice with this they they plan to guard you they wanted to take you out they wanted to spend time with you it maybe that was the only way that they could say they could get into your presence maybe that's all you was offering divine infinite light being because sometimes you know we get into that mood where that's all we gonna offer is this one night stand and we good we just need to get our rocks off we just need to blow the top and we good i say but in the instant, when they was being that playerette and that player, confirmation, they realized that they had to protect you from this one night stand. They had to protect you from these illusions. They had to protect you from making you an option because spirit said, hell to the knees old. H to the, uh, in, uh, no, they, no, fuck Jay-Z. Um, anyways, ten of swords. <laughs> Somebody could like Jay-Z ugly ass. Yeah, because he is ugly. His spirit is ugly. I'm not talking about his avatar. I'm talking about his spirit. Ashe, it's a spiritual war out here. And he is one of the ones that's against the chosen ones. Ashe, one of the ones that lead people down to darkness. Ashe, one of the ones that abuse Hurt, rob, kill, steal, motherfuckers. That's a Jay-Z, and I don't like him. Yeah, he betrayed motherfuckers. Jay-Z, and I don't like him. But anyways, they didn't want an ending in this relationship. They That's not what they was looking for. No, I didn't mean to turn you on. I don't want to fuck you and leave you alone. No, I just don't. 
Ashe. Clarify this, Princess of Cups. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you, Spirit. We're going to make this short. I'm not going to make this too long for y'all. I'm not going to make this too long for y'all. Let's just get three more cards, Spirit. Clarify these three that's laying out here. Thank you, Spirit. We got the Prince of Cups. We got the Four of Wands. And we got the Princess of Swords, Ashe. So we know they watching you. They watching you. Confirmation with the bells in the background, Ashe. Seven of Swords. They're trying to strategize how to make it right. How to make a real... Um, so some of y'all could have said, fuck y'all. After they said, okay, if you, um, they don't want no one night stand, you could have said, okay, forget it. I don't want to deal with you no more. Or you, um, something happened in the relationship to, if y'all was, um, being that buddy or that fuck partner, something happened to where it was death. Y'all separated. Ashe. And they trying to strategize how to get back to you. Thank you, Spirit. What else do you have for the Divine Collective Massive Energy, Feminine and Masculine Energy? I say Chariot. Yeah, strategize how to get back to you. Here it is. Landing right on top of the Two of Cups. Landing right on top of the Princess of Cups. Here it is. The Chariot. So you could be dealing with a water sign. This is the Cancer right here. We got Fire. Virgo. We we got... um. Excuse me. We got Earth. Virgo. Capricorn. And Taurus. We got Fire. Libra. Aquarius. And Sagittarius. Le Aquarius, I mean, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius, Ashe, and then we also have the air signs, Ashe, yeah, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, Ashe, everything is on, um, in this reading, all signs, we embody all signs, you gotta remember that, signs is not important, because we vary in signs in different aspects of our chart and different days of the of the fucking week. Ashe, but somebody wanted to know about the signs, and so I said them. Ashe, Ashe. This chariot, Ashe, they want to come riding in. Ashe, they want to come riding in and telling you that they want more than just sex. Because that's what a one-night stand is. A one-night stand is sex. So they want more than just sex. They want a partnership. Ashe, they want a partnership. This could be your divine um, ten of cups. What the fuck? Ten of cups. Four of wands. Seven of wands. They deeply want to protect this. Because they see how much abundance, how much um, they've been manifesting you. This is a manifestation right here. This is a manifestation. Spirit said this is a manifestation of theirs or yours. Whichever one. Because that's why they didn't want to turn you on. Because they seen that you really truly wanted love. Even though you wanted to get your rocks off. Or you didn't mind hooking up every now and then. Ashe. They see that you truly wanted love such as they do as well. Ashe. This ten of cups. I say this four of wands, this ten of cups landing right on top of this four of wands. And they want to protect this relationship. They are protective over you. I say confirmation. Thank you, spirit. One more card. Thank you, spirit, to clarify this princess of swords. Thank you, spirit. They are protective over you. They want this relationship. No fucking and leaving me. Don't fuck me and leave me. Don't make me feel good and intimate and 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 peaceful and and harmonious and all that, you know, going into my kundalini tantric sex energy and then you fucking leave me no they don't want that 211 on the clock 211 we got 211 right here 211 211 on the clock so that is a confirmation of um um spirit number ashe 211 on the clock 211 on the clock what is the meaning? Ain't, oh. 
What is the angel number meaning of 211? What's the angel number 211? Come on. Ah. Angel number 211 is a reminder to maintain a positive mindset and believe in oneself. It, it encourages people to trust in their abilities, remain optimistic, and embrace new opportunities that come. That come. The angel, the, this number also signifies the importance of balance, harmony, relationships, and life. Ashe, so this is, this is significant. 211, 211, we got 211 in the angel number, we got 211 on the clock, and we got the meaning of 211, it's a balance of harmony, they wanted the, the, the didn't, didn't spirit just say they didn't want to, to get all that harmonious energy, and then for you to leave it, leave them, they wanted a balanced harmony, so that's why they didn't want to just continue to keep fucking on you, or continue, or Try to even just give you a one night stand. Ashe, they wanted the world with you. This is what they want with you. The world. Ashe, the world. Ashe, they can they see um, their world which you can be blissful. Ashe, it could be happy. It could be promising. It could be prosperous. It could be fertile. Ashe, they see this. Ashe, clarify. Thank you, spirit. This um, this princess of swords, them them um, watching you. Somebody is GPSing you, Ashe. Um, somebody knows how to get into your phone. They got your access code. I need to change my access code. Thank you, spirit. That is a confirmation for me. Because <laughs> this nigga down the street know my code. So, yeah, I need to change my access code, Ashe. Pennywise down the street. With his crusty dry hair, Ashe. Yeah. Thank you, Spirit. Shots fired. Pew, 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 pew. One more card. Two more cards. Two of coins. They don't want to juggle. They don't want you to juggle. They don't want to be a juggle. They don't want to feel like a juggle. They want to have a solid foundation. Point blank period with you, Ashe. This is landing right on top of the Nine of Swords with this, with the um, Princes of Swords. They watching you with this Two of, of um, Pentacles. They want it to be stable. They want to make you a priority, and they want to talk to you. This is a bonus. They want to come in and they want to tell you this, Ashe. The reason why I couldn't fuck you and leave you because I want more. The reason why I stopped fucking on you and, and just fucking on you and not giving you nothing because I truly want more. You know, the reason why, you know, um, I held back is because I want more. I say I felt some kind of spark with you. I felt some kind of love with you. I felt interest in you. Divine infinite light being. Yeah. And they didn't want to get left behind. They didn't want to feel regret, you know, of just taking advantage of you, Ashe. And some of them feel regret because some of them did just, you know, um, fuck you a couple of times and, you know, and the relationship some kind of ended. We've seen that with the death card and now they're regretful about it because they want to come back in and talk to you. I say they want to come back in and collaborate with you. They want to come back in and ten of cups you. They want to come back in and love you. I say confirmation with 216 on the clock. What else do you have for um, the divine infinite light beings in this precious moment? Um, spirit. Why? You asked why, now you know why. You was asking, why didn't they fuck me? Why didn't we go through it? Why did he say, ah, I didn't mean to turn you on? Yeah. Because they know spirit watching. 
They know spirit watching, and they know you were a valuable soul, a precious soul, a, a, a intimate soul, a, a, a gift, you know? So this is why they didn't fucking keep, keep taking advantage of you, or they didn't take advantage of you. That's why. Yeah. You want to know why? Because you are queen of wands. You are the queen, the match to this king of wands. They want the same love. They want to give you the same love. They want to receive the same love. Ashe, Ashe. Ooh, sudden wealth. Somebody getting ready to come into some sudden wealth. Ashe. So remember that somebody getting ready to come into some sudden wealth, and they see that they could prosper with you. This ten of cups. We. They, they keep saying it. They keep saying it. They see this shit in you. The 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 um. The fruitalness of it. The, you being fertile. Y'all being fertile together. Y'all, you know, this could be, you know, somebody want to partner up with you in, in, in a business aspect as well. Um, over a, a, um, a love aspect, Ashe. It could be both ways. Ashe, sudden wealth. That's good. That's a blessing. Ashe, thank you, Spirit, for that. Telling me to cut the... Let me pull my chair up and suck on some water right fast. Yes, excuse me for that. But this shit blew me back. Romantic love. That's what they want. I say somebody could be 34 years old. I say, um, but they want some romantic love. I say somebody could have seven children. I say, or somebody could have a seven year old. I say the frequency of romantic love support our experience to know ourselves through the reflection of a curious lover, a conscious lover. So this 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 lover is very curious as well because we see that with the um, page of swords, always watching you, curious to know what you're doing. So that's why curious came out. But conscious, they they went into their conscious mind. Then spirits say they 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 wanted to protect you from these illusions. So they were very conscious of not doing, um, going past the boundaries of you, Ashe. They were very conscious, Ashe, and because of the frequency that you hold. It was a high vibrational frequency. They knew that you wasn't just no um, fuck girl or no fuck guy. You, you feel me? They felt love with this shit. They didn't spirit say you, they reflect something reflected. Did, did spirit say that in this one? I, I do so many. But yeah, they seen the, ref yeah, I think spirit said it in this one. That they seen what, they seen the love in you as they have. Ashe. They seen the love in you as they have. Ashe. Ashe. And so, um, yeah, sensuality. They have some sensuality towards you. The frequency of sensuality helps us to open to the world of um, subtlety sub 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 and details while um, anchoring in the subtract subtractable oh, subtractable. <laughs> Subtractural foundation, thus supporting us to become more fully multidimensional. Ashe, so they wanted to become fully multidimensional with you. Ashe, they wanted a stern foundation fully. Ashe, Ashe. And so, yeah, they felt that frequency. You let off the same frequency they let off. They felt more than just a one-night stand. They felt romantic feelings about you. Romantic feelings, Ashe. That's more than just a one-night stand. Confirmation. Confirmation. Thank you, Spirit. Can you give us a couple of... Thank you. So somebody wants your forgiveness, Ashe. 
somebody wants your forgiveness. That could be the person that you were starting to, you know, see every once in a while and something happened. I say, um, forgiveness, the energy of forgiveness strengthen, strengthens our capacity to let go of unwanted feelings and emotions. So somebody is feeling some unwanted feelings and emotions with two two twenty two on the clock. I say that is also a divine um a divine angel number for connections. What is um angel number twenty two? Uh what is angel number two what is angel number two two two? It says, what does the angel number mean when you think of someone? Someone is all, seeing angel, seeing 222 two, two, when thinking of someone is often dedicated that the person is thinking a lot, a lot about you too. Not only that, but the person could be your soulmate as the intensely, as, as the intensely, intense and in, as the intense intensifies is is so strong it, intensity i've never seen it like that as the intensity is so strong keep all thoughts positive as this person will pick up on them i say yeah. Connections. Law of attraction. Two, two, two. I say. Angel number two, two, two. Look it up again if you need to. I say, but that is synchronicity over here. So that two, two, two was a definite, de de definite, a definite indication, a definite confirmation, a definite synchronicity that this person that we are um, receiving these messages from is thinking of you in this exact moment. I say originality, the frequency of originality supports our capacity to be unique and original Create creators of unlimited possibilities in every moment and this person seen this in you this person felt this in you this person this is why this person didn't want to take advantage of you i didn't mean to turn you on like that because i see some more in you your originality you are authentic i say i i seen that you weren't that type of person to be used and abused and fucked on I seen this in you. This is what this person is telling you right now. Grace. The frequency of grace supports our smooth adaption to the um anti 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 and <laughs> Woo goodness, come on. Anticipation <laughs> of life. Um certain and certain certain anticipation of life. Certains and changes as we evolve towards a higher vision of ourselves on this earthly plane. Bring the divine with a human essence. So they seen the divine. They seen that you were this earth angel. They seen that you were of the divine. They seen that you carried the essence of of divine in human form remember we are all souls in human forms here to shine and spread our light within the world i say within this earthly earth, earthly earth earthly plane i say but a lot of people don't do that they're just fuck girls and fuck boys i say and they seen that you were not that fuck boy and that fuck girl because you carry grace confirmation grace I shave, and so I'm going to leave it there.
I'm going to leave it there. But somebody out there wants your forgiveness. They want back in. They see this within you. Ashe. So you take these messages as they resonate for you. Every It's going to resonate differently from everyone. Ashe. Because there was several different messages in here. In different the way they laid out on your timeline. Ashe. However it resonated for you. Ashe. Spirit broke it down in. I, I believe three different ways I say I say and so um yeah yeah that th this was nice too I say so this is why they didn't they, they they're telling you they didn't mean to turn you on but they really want to turn you on turn on to you tap into you confirmation tune in turn on and tap in to you for life I want to get it right, get it right for life. Teach me how to get it right, get it right for life. This is what they want. That's that. That's um, Robin Thicke. I want to get it right, get it right for life. You know, um, yeah, so maybe you need to go listen to that as well. But I'm sending out loving, healing energy out your way in your present moment on this present day, Ashe. Um, wishing that you have the open heart, the open mind, and the open hands to receive all this goodness of the divine's energy. Ashe, Ashe, because it's coming from the divine. Ashe, I get my energy from the divine, Ashe, and so it's coming from the divine. Ashe, through me to you, healing energy. Ashe, be open and receptive to receive it. Ashe, because it is very powerful in this present moment i say listen to the chimes of the confirmation in the back background i say so i'm sending my love to you i say i'm sending my love to you i say in this very present moment on this very present day i say i say Mwah.